in with an arraignment held this morning in the case of Salinas City Council member Jose Castaneda. He faces misdemeanor charges of driving with a suspended license and driving without insurance. And so we get the details now. From Action News Report, Felix Cortez, he joins us from the Monterey County Courthouse. Well, Dale, Jose Castaneda today pleaded not guilty to those charges in a Salinas courtroom this morning, but it's what was said outside the courthouse that is raising more questions. Castaneda's attorney today saying that the councilman is the target of a witch hunt by Salinas PD. The charges against uh, Jose Castaneda stem from an unpaid traffic ticket several years ago that eventually led to the councilman's license being suspended. Castaneda's attorney said his client believed the fine had been paid and was not aware of his license being suspended. Now here's where it gets tricky. Upon learning of the suspension, police apparently staked out Castaneda's home waiting for him to drive away. Castaneda's attorney said police wouldn't do the same for the average driver accused and accused police of going on a witch hunt. Under the doctrine of people versus Mergia, selective enforcement of the law, the police cannot set out to um, sing, single out uh, a single individual just because they don't like him and, and enforce the law only against him. And that's what they're doing here. Seven, Judge Halsey and now, Castaneda was ordered back to court April 30th, and uh, again, this isn't the only trouble Castaneda's in. He's currently under investigation for a confrontation he had with a tamale delivery man outside his home. Today, we learned police have completed more follow-up and have sent that case back to prosecutors for review. But again, today, the attorney for Castaneda making some strong allegations against Salinas police as to how they handled the driving case against Castaneda a short while ago. Police reached out to me and said they do not, do not do selective enforcement and that Castaneda was in no way targeted because of who he is and his position. I'll have much more on this story coming up on later editions of Action News 8 at 5 and 6. Reporting from outside the Salinas Courthouse, I'm Felix Cortez, KSBW Action News 8.